然后我的也让迷魂回来，世纪帝国四。那么，哎，跟大家稍微讲一下，就是最近录制影片一直掉链子，真的这样，不知道是自己怎么了。对，反正就是我我的那个，反正就是录制影片的时候常常会有一点问题。那最主要就是为什么会突然这样讲，就是因为我们的。暗黑破坏神二浴火重生的死灵法师少了一一段一小段的剧情，对，呃不也不那个也没有到剧情，应该说过程啊，对，有一有一段过程不见了，对，那个在上在昨天的影片就破出来了，对，然后接下来要跟大家讲就是我的实况哈，将即将回来，哎，就就是在呃发布这一集影片的时候是隔天了，对。反正我的实况回来了，嗯，大家如果有兴趣的话，就嗯，多关照一下，谢谢。好了，那我们就继续我们的战役吧。Both sides had had enough, so they made a deal. Matilda would surrender her claim to the throne on condition that when Stephen died, her eldest living son Henry would succeed him. A year later, he was crowned King Henry II, and proceeded to grow the kingdom into the mighty Angevin Empire. But once again, what the king had spent his life building. His own children were destined to destroy. King Henry II had four surviving legitimate sons, and he planned to divide up his kingdom between them. But they fought bitterly for dominance. Against the odds, Henry's youngest son John became king. But King John was deeply unpopular. He lost huge swathes of the Angevin Empire gained by his father, then failed to reclaim them in expensive battles, paid for by taxing his subjects. Eventually, England's barons could take it no more. They forced John to agree to a charter that restricted his power. The Magna Carta, but he went against his word. Furious, they rebelled, inviting Prince Louis of France to invade England. In 1216, Louis sailed to Dover and set his sights on taking this: Dover Castle. Held by forces loyal to King John, it was commanded by Hubert de Burgh. He described the castle as the key to England. He was right. If it fell to the French, so would the kingdom. Fu,围城长，被约翰国王激怒的英格兰贵族党开了全面叛乱，引引来法兰西人入侵，直击约翰国王的痛处。入关键的防御堡垒在此时挡住他们的去路，使多古城堡哦这么快就马上。要走到底了，没关系。我们的战役其实不是只有这一、这一、这一个，是很多个战役
asked to invade by the rebel barons, Prince Louis's French army launched an assault on the castle at Dover. Opening a crack in the outer defenses, the invading forces charged the castle walls. The garrison at Dover would meet the French with clenched fists and an iron will. Dover could not fall. Commander Hubert de Burr rallied his men to hold what back the French and defend the castle. While the castle's garrison thwarted the first French attack and prepared for a second, a new resistance force was building in the English countryside. A skilled bowman and fierce patriot, known as Willikin of the Weald, began to muster a resistance to the French invasion. Determined to keep the crown in King John's hands, Willikin would rally every available archer to the cause. Ah. With his bowmen assembled, Willikin planned to ambush the French siege engines on their way to the enemy camp. Mm? 
Tu ja. Du 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 Willikin's band of archers made short work of the French reinforcements. But if they hoped to ease the burden on Dover's garrison, Willikin's ambush force could not relent. Willikin's resistance force continued to grow, adding more skilled men to its ranks. What needeth be undone? Hey, every chance, there is the Uta, every chance. What needeth be undone? It intendeth, Brackers. I'll sweep them, yes. Where are the lenders? Testers for Allah here. What needeth be undone? Be of yard to Hestes to talk. I think they. Marita, what needeth worker? Tolkas, Das 
is good. Hey, every job intended. Frekes Harken, New Hestus. Frekes, intended new. A Titan Armas! Ferrer! Seeth the Hestes. Eco have it. Arita, what berende su a het? Eco have it that he built the man off. The French launched a renewed attack on the castle. But thanks to Willikin's ambush force, the enemy had been greatly weakened. With Willikin's archers weakening the siege from outside the castle, the garrison at Dover repelled the French attack. Willikin ordered his archers to resume their strikes on the French reinforcements. Building done. It looketh good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So with the head. Equal and gain of the ripper railings now. 
What needeth be undone? On men way. Pest us for all. Step back to his hard way to work at.
Quoi of Surfer Shetter? What needeth be undone? Yahweh Shetter. Is a boon. Farita, what day this worker? Well, then they not break the news. Hmm, in limited resources, you have to do this. You have to do this. 对，毕竟这是在有限的资源里啊Willikens archers had decimated the French reinforcements, but undeterred, the French mustered what troops they could and launched another attack on the castle. The hardy English garrison held fast, refusing to let the castle fall to the French invaders. Willikin rallied his archers to continue strikes on the weakening French. <laughs> Virtue guides me way. Dress and for need, Hester. So Hester had the end. Hester's new. What will me way is clear. Hester's comers. Tidwin left. There eth. Sewer they had. Hester's own to him. For end. Here at Hester's. Hester's comers are way men. Each on the stone.
Frekis Haken, New Hestus. Kiera has Asteria, brought thy army men. Boom to him, thy will be Idun. Entender, Frecklidande, ne hurter. Yes, is she? Who stay Tulkas? Heriende, Hestes, do. What will thou, that well of Idun? The way is clear. Dress of your army men. It's in Shetan.我觉得好像可以打进来呢。对啊别别别别别别别别别去挑衅人家，不然我觉得打的。
，这不真是没差啦，老实说。嗯，因为看起来好像已经，对，要等要等那个下一波了。我已经在等下一波了，我已经在等下一波。往外打，算了啦，我们这守城就不要去招惹人家了。虽然说我我原本有打算造一些轻轻型投石车，然后往外打，对。好了，能闲着也是闲着。而我资源够吗？应该够吧。那我的食物很多肉都超便宜，呃，被我卖到超便宜。商务。啊，你们安息吧。刚刚这是最后一波了。The English garrison and Willikin's surprise attacks ensured that Dover hadn't fallen yet. Now the English prepared to repel the final French assault.啊！不要以为工程工程单位只能工程啊，工程单位是可以那个的，也是可以供给的啊。跟我们打 boy。每次去招惹人家，对，这里根本打不掉。The tenacity of Hubert de Burgh's loyal soldiers forced Prince Louis and the rebel barons to abandon their siege at Dover. And thanks to the efforts of Willikin's fearless archers, England remained in King John's hands. 胜利
，大家有兴趣的话暂停看一下。OK， 那么今天这一集影片，哎，就到这吧。对，接下来下一年不知道是不是直接做个结束了，不知道。我们来看一下吧。对啊。哦，最后了，没错，最后了。OK， 那么这就是下。一集的内容啦，嗯，今天这一集就先到这啦，谢谢大家的观看啦，喜欢我的面包按赞加订阅，有什么想看的游戏可以在下方留言告诉我，就我们就下集见，大家不不。拜拜